Ladies and gentlemen, this is your favorite magical boy, Bamboo Fighting. And today I just wanted to do a little video to talk about the drastic turnaround I've had regarding Demon X Machina thanks to the latest demo. When the game was first announced, it looked really, really cool. Promising action-packed mech battles in a vibrant, cell-shaded-ish environment against all manner of enemies so intimidating you'll shit your pants. And then the Prologue Missions demo released in February, and I was less than impressed. Seven months later, I couldn't quite remember why, but with the power of Twitter history, I can see that my complaints were exhausted. Performance issues, janky controls, poor feature implementation, and gaping holes in basic quality of life things turned Demon X Machina from a day one purchase to a bargain bin buy. So when a second demo was birthed onto the eShop's sterile floors, I didn't really care, but the price of admission was free, so I checked it out anyway, and good lord am I glad I did. The issues that crippled the Prologue Missions demo were completely eradicated in this second sampling. The frame rate is no longer an inconsistent and nauseating nightmare, and while I don't know exactly what it's running at, it never bothered me this time, which is a huge improvement, and it seems to have come at very little cost since the game's wonderful aesthetic remains intact and looking as lovely as ever. Smaller enemies are no longer impossible to find thanks to visibility tweaks and directional indicators, and gunfire feels great thanks to its soundbite being changed from peace slapping against tin to high caliber pounding. And finally, although not entirely without issue, the controls have gone from a malfunctional nightmare to a fluid dream. It's miraculous to me that the team at Marvelous have been able to take a clunky turd and turn it into such a delightful thing that has not only redeemed its status as a day one purchase, but perhaps even a collector's edition if I can somehow justify the 90 quid. But just what is it that's got me more excited than a weeb at a maid cafe? The action is a real blast. The demo has you flying about the small maps in bite-sized missions, laying waste to dozens of mechanical monsters of malintent in a radical robot. And one of the real appeals to me is just how fast and frantic the whole thing is without becoming a confusing mess. You don't really have to aim your weapons too strictly. If something is on screen and you pull the trigger, it's likely getting smoked. And while this lack of fidelity would normally set off my enrage timer, this looser, more forgiving gameplay allows for a much more fast-paced and high-octane gameplay experience that made me feel like a spectacular badass. The soundtrack's pretty awesome too, complementing the heavy gunplay with some heavier metal. The other real gameplay appeal for me was the mech customization, injecting a little bit of JRPG character building into this robotic roller coaster. Although the demo obviously doesn't include the entire arsenal, weapons and parts can be purchased or plundered and stuck in all kinds of different arrangements, and even in the limited demo I felt like there were a lot of different ways to build my mech. I'm really looking forward to seeing what kind of combinations I can conjure with the full array of artisanal and artistic artillery under my authority, in terms of both function and fashion. I certainly won't be going for a purple and green paint job though. Finally, the real surprise of the demo for me is its colourful cast of curious characters. These guys are some of the most cliché collection of weirdos I've ever seen, and I love it. The worst of anime tropes is by far my biggest guilty pleasure, and this game looks set to be absolutely packed with them, and I can't wait to see what absolute bullshit these guys have in store for us. If the game doesn't end with an espousal of the power of friendship, or a bad guy trying to turn humanity into a homogenous blob, I'll be pissed off. Demon X Machina's developers have done a marvellous job of tweaking this game with some much needed improvements that have turned this magical boy from a disappointed Debbie Downer to an excited and eager enthusiast for the game's release later this week. Demon X Machina will hopefully turn out as great as this new demo seems, serving as a symbol to developers that no game is irredeemable given the right care and attention, and to the players not to rely on a first impression. Of course, it could still turn out to be shit, and then this video is going to look real dumb. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for watching, liking, and subscribing. And as to Demon X Machina's eventual fate, will it soar in the skies or crash and burn? We'll find out next time on Bamboo Fighting.